Hello everyone, welcome to Chemizon Complete Chemistry. So this is another question from the same paper of December 2023 Chemistry Part B. So here a compound is given. What we have to do is a correct match for the protons of ethyl acrylate given in column P. So in column P, the protons are given HA, HB and HC. We have to match it with the correct value of the chemical shifts in PPM in column Q. So these values are what? These are what? These are chemical shift values. Okay. What is J? J is what? J is coupling constant. Okay. And this is the frequency. So what we have to do is the first thing that we can do is the the most easiest part you can do is to predict the value of chemical shift. Now, we know that the carbonyl group is what? It is, it is electron withdrawing group because oxygen is more electronegative, right? So, this will withdraw electrons from this bond. So, which proton is closest to, to carbonyl group? This is what? This is electron withdrawing group. Okay, carbonyl group is what? It is electron withdrawing. So what it will do? It will deshield the nearest proton. So which is the nearest proton? HC. So the chemical shift value of HC will be maximum. Why? Because it is closest to the electron withdrawing group. So it will withdraw the electron density around HC and hence the, the external magnetic field experienced by HC will be maximum. So the chemical shift value for HC will be maximum. Now which is the maximum value you find out? 6.11. 6.4 and 5.88 which is maximum 6.11 or 6.11 so we have got partial answer that is hc it should be 1 okay hc should be 1 now next is between ha and hb how do you compare okay ha and hb how do you compare for that what is going to be helpful is this coupling constant value so this is a table for coupling constant of different protons so you can see alkane protons the coupling constant is 6 to 8 hertz then this is what this is cis coupling both are cis protons so that is 6 to 15 for trans okay for trans it is 11 to 18 then both the hydrogens present on the same carbon that is called geminal so for geminal protons it is what 0 to 5 hertz then ortho meta and para also is given so this is very very important you must know these values so for cis it is lower 6 to 15 now okay let me erase this for a while now if you compare hc and hb they are what they are trans to each other they are what they are trans to each other okay so hc is trans to hb and what is a coupling constant value for trans it is 11 to 18 so which value falls between 11 to 18 16 correct so for hc okay for hc and hb for both these cases the coupling constant will be same so for hc the value of j is 16 so for hb also if you write down for HB also, the coupling constant will be how much? It will be same, that is 16, because they are trans to each other. So, that is trans coupling that is taking place. So, for HB, which is going to be the correct answer? The one that is 16. So, for HB, it is 2. Okay, so for, I want to write down the answer. HB, it is option 2. Okay, then comes HA. Now HA, if you compare HA and HC, okay, HA and HC, they are what? They are cis to each other. So HA is cis to HC. So it will be having which coupling range? It will be co having coupling constant of between 6 to 15, that is D. Okay, that is J is equal to 10, that is option third. So for HA, it is the correct option is 3. The correct answer is what? It is 3. Okay, so which is going to be the correct option? 
Okay, I've not mentioned the options. I will write down the final answers here. For A, A it will be 3. Okay, for B it will be 2. And for C, it is 1. So the correct answer will be 3, 2, 1. So, the most important part is that you analyze both the concepts. First is chemical shift. You must know how to analyze the chemical shift values based on the electron withdrawing or electron donating group. So, you must have the knowledge whether this group is electron withdrawing or electron donating. It is electron withdrawing. So, accordingly, this will be most de-shielded HC. So, its chemical shift will be maximum that is 6.11. Okay, then between HA and HP, how did we distinguish using the coupling constant value? So, you can remember this table. It is very important. Now, they, has, uh, they have asked between cis and trans. Next time, maybe they might ask between ortho coupling, meta coupling and para coupling that you must know. Ortho coupling is maximum 7 to 10, meta is 2 to 3 and para is what? 0 to 1. So, they can, uh, in this way, they can change or modify the question and ask in the next paper. So, I hope you have understood the solution. Thank you.